An underwater volcano has erupted near the Challenger Deep, the deepest known point on Earth. The eruption triggered a massive tsunami that struck Tonga, causing widespread devastation. Tsunami advisories were also issued for the U.S. West Coast and Alaska. This eruption, located in the Mariana Trench, has shocked scientists and geologists. It highlights the raw, untapped power beneath the ocean's surface. Satellite images captured the scale of destruction, while seismic monitors detected unprecedented activity. Such events provide a rare opportunity to study the geological processes occurring deep beneath the ocean. The Challenger Deep is part of the Mariana Trench, which is nearly 36,000 feet deep. The conditions at this depth are extreme, with crushing pressures that are difficult to simulate. This event showcases how little we know about underwater geological activity. Understanding underwater volcanoes is vital for global safety and environmental health. The eruption also raises questions about its long-term impact on the ecosystem and marine life. It may influence future studies of underwater tectonic activity. The recent activity is a reminder of Earth's dynamic nature and the ongoing need to explore the ocean. This eruption will likely have far-reaching consequences that demand our attention. Underwater volcanoes are responsible for over 70% of the planet's volcanic activity. Unlike land volcanoes, their eruptions occur far below the ocean surface, making them difficult to observe. They are often concealed by thousands of feet of water. Scientists rely on remote sensing technology and seismic monitoring to study these eruptions. The volcanic activity produces superheated magma that interacts with water, creating unique lava formations. One recent example is the West Mata volcano near Fiji. Its eruptions released magma at over 2,200 degrees Fahrenheit, lighting up the deep ocean momentarily. The intense pressure at these depths alters the behavior of magma. On land, eruptions are explosive due to the rapid release of gas. Underwater, the crushing pressure of the ocean suppresses such explosions. This creates lava flows and formations that are distinct from those found on land. The interaction between magma and water produces a phenomenon called quenching. This process rapidly cools magma, solidifying it into new rock. This adds to the seafloor's growth and alters the ocean's geological landscape. Studying these volcanoes helps us understand Earth's processes better. Their activity also plays a role in shaping the ocean floor, influencing marine ecosystems and global geology. Studying underwater volcanoes requires advanced technology. Traditional observation methods are ineffective at extreme depths. Modern tools such as seismic sensors, satellite imagery, and underwater drones have revolutionized the field. These technologies provide real-time data on volcanic activity. Seismic sensors placed on the ocean floor detect vibrations caused by magma movement. These instruments help pinpoint the location and intensity of eruptions. Satellites provide aerial views of changes in the water's surface, such as discoloration or disturbances. These signals often indicate volcanic activity below. Underwater drones and remotely operated vehicles, ROVs, are essential for exploring deep sea volcanoes. Equipped with cameras and sampling tools, they capture images and collect samples directly from eruption sites. AI and machine learning are also being used to analyze patterns in volcanic activity. These tools predict future eruptions, offering valuable warning systems for coastal areas. Hydroacoustic sensors detect sound waves from underwater eruptions. These sensors are critical for monitoring remote volcanoes. Combined with other technologies, they improve our understanding of underwater geological processes. Research teams around the world are collaborating to expand monitoring networks. These efforts aim to improve safety and advance scientific knowledge. Volcanic eruptions, both on land and underwater, have played a significant role in shaping human history. Coastal and island communities near the Pacific Rim often live in areas influenced by volcanic activity. These communities have long histories of dealing with the risks posed by nearby volcanoes. Many indigenous cultures have stories and legends about volcanic eruptions. These tales often describe eruptions as the wrath of gods or spirits. Such myths helped early communities explain natural phenomena they could not scientifically understand. Over time, these stories also shaped cultural traditions and practices. For example, 
Polynesian cultures have oral histories describing changes in their islands caused by volcanic activity. These accounts align with geological evidence of eruptions. In modern times, volcanic activity continues to shape economic and social life in these regions. Underwater volcanoes, like those near the Mariana Trench, are harder to connect with cultural stories. However, their effects, such as tsunamis, have had significant impacts on coastal societies. Historical records show that volcanic tsunamis have caused widespread destruction. Understanding these events through a cultural lens provides valuable insights. It also highlights the resilience of communities living near such dynamic environments. Underwater volcanoes are vital to Earth's geology. They create seamounts, underwater mountains that shape the ocean floor. Some seamounts eventually grow into islands. The Hawaiian Islands are a prime example of volcanic land formation. The eruption near the Challenger Deep demonstrates the geological power of underwater volcanoes. These eruptions add new material to the seafloor, altering the topography. Hydrothermal vents, formed during eruptions, are another significant feature. These vents release mineral-rich water, creating unique ecosystems. These ecosystems rely on chemosynthesis, a process where organisms derive energy from chemicals instead of sunlight. Hydrothermal vents are hotspots for biodiversity. They support species that thrive in extreme conditions. Studying these ecosystems provides insights into how life can adapt to harsh environments. Volcanic activity also influences ocean chemistry. The release of gases like carbon dioxide and sulfur dioxide affects marine life. It can lead to changes in water acidity, impacting coral reefs and fish populations. These changes have ripple effects on global ecosystems. The geological and ecological significance of underwater volcanoes cannot be overstated. They are crucial to understanding Earth's processes and the interconnectedness of life on our planet. Underwater volcanic activity has both risks and opportunities. The minerals released during eruptions can include rare earth elements. These elements are vital for modern technology, such as smartphones and renewable energy systems. Mining these materials could boost economic development. However, deep sea mining carries environmental risks. Disturbing the seafloor could harm ecosystems that are still poorly understood. Hydrothermal vent communities, for example, are delicate and may not recover from such disruptions. Balancing economic interests with environmental protection is a significant challenge. Volcanic eruptions can also disrupt fisheries. Changes in water temperature and chemistry can affect fish populations. This impacts communities that rely on fishing for their livelihoods. Coastal tourism can also suffer from the aftermath of volcanic tsunamis. Damage to coral reefs and beaches reduces the appeal of tourist destinations. On the other hand, volcanic islands can create new opportunities. They attract scientific research, which can bring funding and resources to local areas. Understanding the economic implications of underwater volcanic activity is essential for sustainable development. Governments and industries must work together to address these challenges. The environmental impact of underwater volcanic eruptions is significant. Eruptions release large amounts of gases and ash into the water. These emissions can alter the chemical composition of the ocean. Increased levels of carbon dioxide and sulfur dioxide can lead to ocean acidification. Ocean acidification affects marine ecosystems, especially coral reefs. Corals struggle to build their skeletons in acidic waters, leading to reef degradation. This impacts marine biodiversity, as reefs are home to many species. Volcanic eruptions also disturb hydrothermal vent ecosystems. Ash and debris can bury these unique habitats threatening the species that depend on them. Some species may adapt to the changes, while others could face extinction. The long-term effects of underwater eruptions on the ocean's health are still not fully understood. Researchers are studying how volcanic activity contributes to global climate patterns. Eruptions release heat into the ocean, influencing currents and temperatures. Protecting marine environments requires a deeper understanding of these processes. Collaborative efforts between scientists, governments, and conservationists are essential. Addressing environmental concerns is crucial for preserving the health of our oceans. The eruption near the Challenger Deep highlights humanity's reliance on technology to study natural phenomena. 
Advanced monitoring systems have allowed scientists to track the eruption in real time. These tools provide crucial data for predicting potential risks. The event also raises questions about humanity's preparedness for natural disasters. Tsunamis triggered by volcanic eruptions can devastate coastal communities. Improved warning systems are needed to reduce the impact of such events. Technological advancements also enable researchers to analyze the eruption's effects on marine ecosystems. Drones and ROVs capture footage of affected areas. These technologies offer insights that were previously impossible to obtain. Understanding the chemical composition of erupted magma can reveal information about Earth's mantle. This knowledge is valuable for studying tectonic activity and predicting future eruptions. It also has applications in resource exploration and environmental management. The eruption underscores the need for international collaboration. Scientists from various fields must work together to address the challenges posed by underwater volcanic activity. Investments in technology and research are critical for advancing our understanding of these events. This eruption near the Challenger Deep is a historic event. It provides a rare opportunity to study geological processes at extreme depths. Comparisons can be drawn to other significant volcanic events, such as the eruption of Mount Pinatubo in 1991. Mount Pinatubo's eruption had global consequences, including a measurable impact on climate. Studying such events helps scientists understand the broader implications of volcanic activity. Underwater eruptions may have similar effects, particularly on ocean chemistry and ecosystems. The Mariana Trench has long been a focus of scientific exploration. Its extreme conditions make it a unique site for studying geology and biology. The recent eruption adds to its significance, offering new data for researchers. Understanding the global significance of such events is essential. They highlight the interconnectedness of Earth systems and the importance of preserving its natural balance. Continued research will likely uncover new insights, deepening our understanding of the planet.